Hey guys, Dr. Carlo here. So, um, the, the sepsi specialist for the hospital came over to talk to us. Basically, we had two simultaneous sepsis patients, one of which we almost missed the time for antibiotic, basically because the nurse was not aware we had activated ED sepsis bundle, so they were not sure we were gonna uh, give medicines, antibiotics, so we almost missed that one hour window. Remember, sepsis and ED antibiotics within one hour is part of the core measure, so we really need to hit that target. So I did my job in terms of putting the orders in, but the patient had already been here, had got an X-ray, and we didn't identify SIRS or sepsis until later on in the visit, so that puts us at a time constraint. So the suggestion was, how do we let the nurses know that we've activated a sepsis bundle, we have somebody who's potentially septic? And the answer comes down to communication. And it's impossible to find nurses, and you're trying to put orders, and you're trying to do charts, and you're trying to see new patients, so I'm not asking you to do any of that. Pick up the phone, dial 2104, that's the extension for the unit secretary. Let them know I have an ED sepsis bundle, room 15. They can in turn call the charge nurse, call the nurse, disseminate that information out. Or if you want, it works even better, it works even quicker. So take the radio says ED sepsis bundle, room 15. This will automatically alert the nurses, all the nurses in the emergency department, that there's a potential septic patient which needs antibiotics, fluids, and all those good things uh, immediately so it'll get done. So that is the update on that. Thank you for using the ED sepsis bundle, the ED sepsis treatment bundle, because that expedites um, the care. And number two, it makes sure that everything that needs to be done is complete on the patient. And that's that.